Hi guys, myself Balakrishna Pujari. Uh, in the today's video, how to solve the uh, thermal temperature distribution on a composite wall. So in on the screen, uh, the wall uh, differentiate have given with a different uh, thickness wall. Uh, so let's start. the k1 k2 k3 and temperature and one side the uh, convection or heat transfer has shown the values the first thickness is 0.3 meter second is a 0.15 meter and 0.15 is the third one so go for the ANSYS epidural preference thermal preprocessor element add element and that add solid 4 node 55 element ok go for the material material model thermal thermal conductivity isotropic the first uh, k value you have to add here and generate the another uh, material id id2 the isotropic we have to consider here the k value as 30 so k1 is 20 k2 is 30 and k4 is 50 so again the new model id3 as isotropic value as 50 now exit now go for the modeling create area by dimension first is 0 and 0.3 so here y as assumed i am assuming as one so thickness uh, length is not given so i am assuming here the one so uh, if uh, data is given that I have to consider or is not given so assume that suitable data zero and one meter apply the first wall has generated second wall is start from point three and here the point four five the point one five has added and again for the third wall 0.45 as a initial and 0 0.6, 0 0.6 as a, uh, the final value so here the three wall has generated now go for the operate in that the boolean so we have to glue the area in between one one another so first area to second area okay and again you have to consider the area as second area to third area so we are applying the glue in the area between two go for the mesh and here we have to set the uh, material as k1 k2 k3 values as the first one is by default you have to set and ok and second uh, the pick area the second one you have to consider the material number 2 id2 and for the third again you have to consider the id material id as 3 <coughs> now go for the mesh and area set first as setting as uh, element edge length as 20 apply for the second as 30 apply and for the third one as 50 apply now go for the mesh and here you have to consider the peak call the mesh is done now go for so here the three different wall have three different uh, structure uh, core uh, fine and uh, very fine so like that we have considered the area set also now go for the load define apply thermal temperature online select the first temperature at the right side temperature the constant temperature as 20 at the right side and the left side the left side the uh, convection force uh, convection heat is added so that you have to consider select the line now we have to add here the convection values that h as uh, 25 and the bulk temperature as 800 
that is a t infinity so applying uh, the force as uh, visible in on the screen now go, go for the solution solve current ls solution is done now go for the general post processor plot result counter plot nodal solution nodal temperature so here the temperature distribution for the composite wall the initial is 20 and the final is varying the convection as 304.76 okay thank you